So, uh... Welcome back, everyone. On the Black Shadow and... Wow. I've had a few minutes to think about what the fuck just happened. After uh, searching for a second car for us to use with Braden and Heather, we came back and... Well... This happened. An absolute bloodbath. The consequences of this are, um, naturally pretty fucking damning. We've lost all our medics. They're both dead. There's nothing we can do. All we've got left is school friends Braden and Connor and military man Hawkins. That is all we've got. I... I don't know if I can blame coming to the church for this. I don't think that's a fair thing to say. But holy fuck, everything went to hell here. We've at least managed to fend them off, though. And we have... Well... Survived. Is the best way I can describe it, but... Your order has arrived. Jesus Christ. This was... This was not part of the plan, folks. Not even remotely. So, I guess there's not much we can do here, but to uh, pick up the pieces and try and... I don't even know what I'm meant to do here. This was an absolute fucking catastrophe. Braden nearly died as well. I don't know how the hell I managed to keep Braden alive in amongst of all of that. That was um that was a miracle. Jesus. So what What the hell do we do now? I don't know. I legit don't know. Fucking okay, hell, this is I think that was the Juggernauts, everyone. I mean, there were two Juggernauts that we got assaulted by. As well as Screamers and two or three Hordes. One of which was a, was a freaking... Just guys in body armor. Ten guys would have struggled to fight that. Let alone five. They just moved into the place. Jeez. Well, we, we cannot... We can't just linger, though, and, and sit here crying. We have to push on, unfortunately. As, uh, as much as it sucks. As much as it sucks. We lost our... I don't know if our van is still in some piece. It might be in some piece. But we're going to have to do some uh, repair work here, everyone. We got a couple of toolkits. We're going to take them. We need to repair our cars. We need to... We might as well equip that, sure. Put that away. I'm just... Just totally taken aback by what just happened and how quickly it happened. Like, I cannot... I cannot comprehend how badly everything went. You improved your shooting, which is great. Um... We'll give you sharpshooting. That sounds good for you. Connor is a mess. He's in bad shapes. Uh, give you weapon handling. Like, I just did not envision this happening. Like, we've had a bad history of nights. And I know I'm not playing this on the easy difficulty, but like, holy shit. Right, okay. We need to, we need to work out what we want to do here. 
Right, you've got utilities. You've got constructions you're nearly done with. And you, I can give you something. we got 121, 120. And Braden is... We've now, problem is we've now got no medics. So even though we've got an infirmary... Oh, we, we, I think we have built it. So I think we can treat... We can treat these, I think. Even though we don't have a medic. But it does certainly hinder us. We can't upgrade the infirmary anymore. We... Yeah, there's a lot of problems we have right now. Unmitigated disaster. Right. Okay. We've got all these... Um, Bits and pieces, right? Let's load another gas can. Let's just fix our cars, folks. It's the best thing we can do here. But while I try and decide what to do next, we need more folks. Like to be down to free and have no, no medics. That's bad. It's not like I can't take care of this on my own, but some help would be yeah, acceptable. It's like one of the worst things that I think I've ever had happen to me. In a state of decay game, that that is that is up there. That is so up there. All right, let's repair it with um, with the toolkit. There we go. Give it a refuel. Yeah, that was just a disaster. I thought for a moment the game was over. I literally thought for a time the game was was over there, but. We've managed to uh, not lose yet. Although that is um, that is an enormous setback. It's like, could I have done much about that? I I don't even think I could have done. I literally don't think there's anything I could have done about that. That was just a just a brutal situation. I don't have enough gas can, do I? Because I never took it out. Okay, then. Cool. Right. Well, we've only three folks left. We, um, unfortunately, can't be looking to group up too heavily when it comes to... Uh, when it comes to um, going on trips here. So I think Braden's going to have to go alone here. I'm not comfortable about this decision, but I don't really see what I can do here. Oh, I get what it means. Yeah, so what I mean is, actually, is, um... We don't have anything else that runs nine mils. All the stuff we've got is nine mils are all broken. Uh, we could repair it. Can we just repair it? We don't have the requisite physicality. I... <sighs> Look, I'm sorry. I've just had, like, my fucking team being eaten alive here. Alright. I'm a bit busy right now. Take a mag. Okay. So. As uh, day begins to break on Mega Valley and... Wow. Devastation remains. So with the infirmary... We can treat the blood plague. We can create more vials, but it's going to be much more expensive now because we have no, um, we have no medic. That's the problem. Well, catastrophe. All right then. I've also forgotten why I went in there in the first place to get hold. I, I'm sorry, my mind has just been completely shot by that. I, it's, I've been so fucking taken aback with what's just occurred. Like I'm still trying to comprehend what happened, which is ridiculous, but unfortunately, it's also true. Did I not uh, take that out? I'm pretty sure I did. All right, then. What a mess. Well, guys, 
I'm not. I can't even construct this now without everyone being here. I can't even construct the farm because, like, it's a large place. I can't physically construct. We had don't have the people to do it. That is kind of bonkers. Wow. That is so crippled us. Braden's starting to fall asleep. Right then. Well, in that case. We'll do it later. Hawkins, I think we're gonna have to take over you, man. Yeah, we're starting to. You can see the yeah the sleep work the the stamina is starting to disappear here. There's not much we can do about that. Okay, so store that away and change on over to Hawkins then. Yeah, we'll do it another time. I'm on my way. Shouldn't be too long. Jesus Christ! Even your anyway. thing got broken. Keep right on. then. I'm on the way. So Horgan does have some missions of his own with his share of stuff, um, which is to help like kind of keep the peace between the few groups here. Is the idea. That's his lo that's the logic of it. Don't know where that is. It's over there. Okay. It's not too far away actually. That's kind of the general direction I was looking ahead anyways. Cool. Right, let's give you something bladed so we can keep going. With the bladed thing. Uh, I think the Parang. It's not got the most durability in the world, unfortunately. The problem is, bladed weapons tend not to have very good durability because, you know, they're bladed. It's kind of it's kind of how they work. So we'll just give you that. That'd be fine. And you've got the crossbow, which is nice, I guess. I think, given the fact we're going to be on our own, it's probably not a bad idea to give you that. Uh, what medic stuff have you got here? Painkillers. I tell you what, take that away. We've got some strong painkillers. You're going to take a couple of those. And by a couple, I don't mean take the damn lot. Uh, store that away. And you, I guess, yeah. You can stick with that, I guess. I don't know if sharpshooter really helps, though, with crossbows. I have no idea. I don't think it does. So I tell you what, drop it, and we'll give you back your uh, your rifle, which is the uh, Arctic Warrior. That was his gun, running with seven six twos. We have no seven six twos though. Is the problem? But that's just the way it breaks down. So oh well. Also, that's not what I meant to do. I keep pressing drop when I meant to actually press uh, store. I have a habit of doing this. I've noticed. What the fuck is this? <laughs> oh my god, game. Um, so, I don't think the game quite knows what to do. It's a little confused, everyone. Oh, man. I, I'm not afraid to point shit like that out. I'm not afraid. Oh, that's funny. That is funny. All right, folks, let's get going. Let's dive back into into hell. All right, where are we going? You. Keep that mouth shut. Uh, let's go. I'm going this way due to all the bullshit that's now up north. Hello, Juggernaut. Double Juggernaut. Fucking hell. No wonder we got brutalized. No wonder. All right, then. We will probably need to go and do a bit of inspecting at some point to, um, like, get some uh, some fuel of some kind. I don't know if this is going to last the entire trip. Hello, hello, car. Oh, this doesn't go anywhere. Oh, I knew this was. I knew this was a thing. I wanted to see like if you could traverse for it. I mean, I guess you can. You just do that. That also works. 
Okay then, that's good to know. I better keep an eye out for plague zombies. Yeah, 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 I agree. Let's not hang around here. Right, okay then. So I know I'm going like the wrong way in theory, but I I just don't want to go up north. It's just a terrible idea. Ooh. Hello, you. Survival instinct is a powerful thing, even stronger than the undead. That's a problem we've also got, by the way. We're using up materials for beds that aren't even being, um, aren't even being uh, used at the moment. Would you die? Thank you. Look at this. Military trauma tent, eh? This place would be perfect for an outpost. Give us um, some meds as a as a meds collection as well, which is a good thing considering we have no fucking medical people at the moment. So our drain on medical resources is going to be a lot, lot higher than it normally would be. You know what? Yay. I think I could. Uh, I think I might claim this. Yeah, I think we're going to claim this, folks. It's going to cost three hundred influence. That's fine. Let's do it. Now I have heard that apparently yeah, you see this outpost. It's a thing of beauty. If we uh yes, if so if we um now that we've done this, bear in mind there are still containers for us to search. I've heard that apparently these search quicker now. Because yeah, yeah they do. Okay, uh, thanks for I think it was uh, was a class we said about that. If you're an outpost and you have, you've claimed it but haven't searched stuff, it searches super quick. Apparently it did that at least in the DLC of the game. He wasn't sure if that was the case in the um in the actual main game. Uh, but I'd say he had to have a check, Nothing and yeah, empty. that indeed is the thing. That's quite a useful little feature. Ooh. Oh, it's 556s. Five, five, okay, wrong one, but that's still pretty good. That's still pretty good. Again, just a nice established safe area for us to work with. That's pretty useful. I'm trying to work out what else I need to search here. Okay, there's one thing up there, so I need to get up top. All right, then. I'm, I'm, I'm still, like, mentally not quite in this at the moment, like, because of what happened. I'm still kind of mentally shot by what happened. I, 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 it's just the, the speed of the chaos and how quickly it all happened. Um, and just, like... I mean, that's not the apocalypse for you. That, that's, that, this sort of shit happens. You can't, you know, it, it is a thing. Ooh, that's a fun-looking weapon. Reaching hammer, nice. And a Molotov, sweet. I'll take that as well. But just the speed that everything happened, and the fact that I, 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 I was ready to accept the game being over. Then I was like, I guess we're gonna have to restart the, the game, which I was, I was prepared for that to happen. But it seems like, um, seems like fate's got a little bit more in store for me. Those five, five, sixes. That's a nice little find. That. We'll be careful of the Molotov, I suppose. All right, then. We'll check out the Tartan Mart while we're here. We do, of course, have two outposts running now. Now, if I do want to make, um, do want to get something a bit more relevant That's than quick. the espresso shop, then I will need to, uh, whatchamacallit, I will need to close down the espresso shop, which is fine. Nothing it was never really provided that much for us. It was kind of giving us a morale boost in a time when we were having pretty poor morale, but it's not really doing too much for us as well. We could, like, make, like, fizzy drinks, I guess. Ooh. That's about it. Nothing too much of interest. Oh, Jesus. That so sucks. The loose crews. And Heather as well. Heather had done really well for us since she joined us. Well, like I was, uh, I was gonna like Heather. Let's we've uh, been robbed. Speaking of energy drinks, hello. We're not gonna claim this. Hmm. This place empty. Not much here. Damn. Yeah, the place is empty. That's unfortunate. Gun shop that's already been long since raided. Ah, uh, well, that's uh, that is unfortunate for us. 
I got lazy. I was like, fuck this. <laughs> We're in the clear. Yeah, nothing in here. Okay, that's fine. Cool beans. Let's like, say we're in the clear. Jumping through freaking glass is going to always cause some interest. That was a brutal shot there. Very good. All right, let's drop this off then. The food will do as good as well. Obviously, our food consumption is less than what it was, but still. Energy drink there. That's quite useful. Can I actually... Um, so if we go to our base here... So, yes, yeah, so we've got the espresso stand here, which we can actually still make shots of espresso, which will cost us some food, which we can't really spare right now. Uh, and then the med outpost, which we can't do anything with. It just gives us a med a day. That's literally all it does, which is, you know, better than nothing. But as you can see as well, morale, morale kind of tanking, everyone. I wonder why. Move on. Whitney Field down there, by the way. We're not going there for some time. Don't want to take forever, of course, because eventually, um, even even the great Hawkins will eventually uh, will eventually start tiring, and that would be a bad spot. Wind farm. Oh, it's another outpost area. Okay, that's nice. Been out of our price range, but uh, I mean that would allow us to like get some kind of power going. That'd be pretty sweet. Okay, where am I going? I might go down to the bounty broker and just change like the bloater one. I think that sounds good. Let's go pay a visit to the bounty broker. That sounds good to me. Yeah, I do like how like the um, like the enclaves are a bit annoyed us. Oh, there's a mission we could look to do with the practitioners. They want to reclaim the clinic, don't they? Okay, I tell you what, we'll go ahead and look to do that then. That should give us a, a plenty of influence and might make us some friends. Who knows? They might want to join us. That's highly unlikely. They probably see the see organs like, hey, where's the worst of your gang? It's a bit awkward. Oh, bounty broker. God damn it. Yeah, don't drive into that, Shadow. That's never been well. Nice little orchard area. Very nice. I cannot wait until the last video goes up, though, and just, like, see his reactions and just... There's bound to be one person that thought that the game was over. Because I thought the game was over. I was, I was pretty convinced the game was over. I was pretty damn sure. Greetings. Do come in. How you doing, Cash? Get yourself a nice looking new jump uh, jacket there. Look at you. Very spiffy. Hello, everything. There we go. Cash. Hello, my friend. We need to uh, change this out business? here. This one. I, I don't want that one now. Give me something else I'm not likely to get. Run on 50 zombies. Cheers, Cash. Okay, we need to look to get some fuel from somewhere. I could borrow their car. That sounds good to me. I did fuel it up myself anyway, so yeah, that seems reasonable enough to me. That sounds enough to me. Princess house. <laughs> oh dear. Let's head on south then. One, one thing I will give this game, just as a pure, um, as a, as a plus point, after the hell and everything broke loose, I will give it credit of like the the, 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 the like the music it was playing, like the desolation and everything. I'll give it that. Hi, guys. Don't mind me. Well, we will we'll borrow we'll borrow the car uh, that we gave that we've effectively fueled for them. That's my uh, price for helping them. We're going to use the uh, the, the legendaire. 
carefully drive around, try not to crash our car. That would be kind of embarrassing. This is just feeling amazing. Now. I'm going to need to get some fuel for this, though, before we come back. Like, I don't know how I'm going to do that, but I'm going to need to. Hi, guys. You, sir, you need some help? Oh, thank you. I definitely earned a favor with this. I. Okay. Oh, okay. So they're giving that to me. Okay, then. So now we're actually embarking on it. Okay, that sounds good to me. You come with me, then? Is anyone come with me? I guess not. Oh, shit. Well, guess this is happening. All right then. Did I leave anything in the boot of the car? I don't think I did. Cool. All right then, let's get going. No, looks like I'm doing this by myself. This isn't uh, a recipe for fucking disaster at all. Nope. Not at all. Don't know what you're talking about. Also, this is loud. Is it feral over there? That is definitely feral-like. We're going to need to swing back here on the way back. Uh, he's used up more... Are you still chasing me? Ferals don't like getting run down, by the way. They're very good at avoiding getting hit by cars. That is a, a downside to ferals. Like a lot of enemies you can just try and run down. But that also works. But yeah, ferals are very good at dodging a car. I'm not even sure you can run them down, so... Oh, God. That ain't gonna fit like that. The juggernaut. Man. Who want to who live in a zombie apocalypse, folks? This this place is hell. Maybe we just need to get the fuck out of Mega Valley. Clear out the zombies, though. Well, I don't know one way of clearing out zombies. That didn't take too long, right? Doing an amazing job for us, you know. Oh! Oh my god, did that actually work? Apparently that counted. Well, we're out of here. <laughs> Run! <laughs> We're out of here. Bye! Apparently just luring them away from the house was good enough. They didn't need me to kill them all. Well, that's a result. Yeah, we have completed the mission. Nice. Very good. Very, very good. I, uh... I can live with this. Oi! Get off the... Off my door. That's my door, please. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, apparently just luring them away was was good enough for the practitioners, so I will I'll accept this as a victory. Very nice. Troll hideout. What? Troll hideout. This is so absurd I have to check this out. I hear a bloater, I think. Or to you. That works. Get him, Corkins! Oh, man, you are so good at fighting. Oh, you are so good at fighting. Just, just literally decapitating bullshit. Nice. In Hawkins, we trust, everyone. In Hawkins, we trust. Oh, it's underneath, I guess. Okay, then. Cool. Uh, it must... Oh, troll is in under the bridge. Oh, okay. I get it now. Interesting. Down there. Okay. All right, let's carefully descend. Getting up could be interesting. Yeah, look at this. Oh dear. I don't think the owner's going to mind me uh, having a look. Caught a hunch. Hmm. 
Doesn't seem like the greatest place to hide out in a zombie apocalypse, if you ask me. In my many distinguished years of dealing with zombie apocalypses. This load is quite heavy. I'm glad I came back here. I'm very glad I decided to come under here. Ooh, that's a nice little, uh, nice little hole. Very sweet. All right then. Let's go pay a visit back to the practitioners. I might actually sell the crossbow because we've already got one. I don't really think we need more than one. Um, I need to get my car anyway. So I think I'm actually might. I might go ahead and just sell those. Do we have inventory space? We have inventory space. Just. A weird signal. I mean, I guess we could. You get some fuel first. Where's the fuel station? There's the gas. The gas pumps over there somewhere. Ah, oh, and here's the practitioners. All right, so they've now actually moved over here. Sweet. Hi guys. And they will actually give us, uh, they're happy to give us medical advice on radio command as well. Oh, uh, much like what we were doing with crews and such. But that's quite bonus. Neat. Hi, guys. How you doing? How are you? Uh, we could have to enlist these followers, but we can't really do that right now. Let's just do some trading. Yeah, I am going to, yeah, I'm going to sell the crossbow here, I reckon. We'll just get, uh, I'm just going to sell that. We're keeping that because that's pretty useful. Uh, we'll sell the energy drink. We'll sell the Molotov. And have you got anything of interest for us? Ooh, that's tempting. Yeah, I think I'll let that go. I think it'll be fine. Will the game actually let me search these? I can do. It seems kind of weird that you can search, like, uh, an ally's um, base like this. It's kind of... It's kind of weird... Because there's nothing stopping you from like just grabbing the stuff, oh, hey talking to them, yeah, and then trading them. them their own yeah. stuff. Okay. There, there, there should be some way of stopping this. <laughs> if you ask me, we're gonna keep that. That's a that's a decent looking weapon. That it's got some huge durability to it too. And I just say, look, I don't need this. You can keep this. Ooh, those could be useful to get actually the cups of coffee. That be yeah, postponing the um, fatigue basically. So what we're having with uh, with uh, Braden. With his exhaustion kicking, I assume that will put a temporary stop to that. Oh, hello, hello. That's a lot to carry. That's heavy as fuck. But hello, that is uh, that is a fun looking facility mod. We're gonna be keeping that for whenever we get uh, a workshop back up and running. Very nice. And there's a case of vitamins. I'll take those. Oh, we are holding so much stuff here. The practitioners are just are sitting there thinking, uh, do you actually have any actual business with us, Hawkins? I'm like, kind of? Sure. Probably. Give me a moment. Nothing left to find here. Some nasty stuff outside. Boxes of seeds. Not happy. I can't use that because I'm actually uh, right. Hey, you. Like hey trade. you! All right. We'll just trade you the bolts. That's fine. And I'll take that. But more seeds, very good. Neat! Neat, 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 neat. Right then, let's get out of here, folks. So the practitioners have actually moved all the way down here and have thus abandoned the lakeside house as where they were, so that's kind of neat. What is that sound? Oh, that's what that sound was. What fuel's in the car here? Might actually be more useful for us to take the trekker. Yeah, I think I'm actually gonna take the trekker. I'm gonna leave the legendy legend here. Oh, oh, oh! Hello. Taking you for a ride. It's probably not bad on fuel consumption either. Actually, it should be a pretty good, good little vehicle for us. Neat. Nice little hot hatchback. Very nice. All right, let's go. Let us go. It's not quite as quick, of course, but that doesn't matter. Right, carefully drive through there. There we are. We're good. 
It's got a fuel canister count on it as well, so we don't even know to need to go and pay a visit to the uh, fuel okay. pumps. This is Twain, broadcasting live from my new improved location. Oh, good. I'm only here thanks to the hard work and... He said he was on the move, didn't he? Made by others in the network. Your efforts were critical, my friends. Keep the faith. No problem, sir. Happy to be of assistance. What am I doing with the stuff that was in the actual car then? And also to that point, what am I doing with the- Hey, would you get out of my car, please? Why did you get in here? <laughs> what is this nonsense? Oh, shit. Okay, this is not a good idea. If you'd like to unhand me, please. Thank you. Right, getting my stuff back is going to be a bit trickier than I had intended. Courtesy of several blood zombies. Well, guess I'm going to have to mow these fuckers down. There we go. Jesus. There's a horde heading our way, but oh, we can handle right. that. Are you kidding me? All right, then. Let's get the trunk out. Uh, let's fuel our car. If the game would let me. Game. Thank you. Great. We have to get back, then. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have played this game on the difficult I am. Maybe that was the mistake I made. It's very possible that is, uh, that is how it's gone, but it's hard to know. Right. Let's drop all this stuff off here. Drop that. Drop all the heavy stuff here. That's pretty heavy. That's really fucking heavy. Okay, good. And take all this stuff, I guess. Oh, I can't actually... Oh, of course I can't because the way the inventory system works. Okay. Careful. That makes sense. Right, let's drop all this in here. And we'll take the other rucksack and call that a day. Good. Uh, If we get an opportunity, I'll come back for this. But... I'm not, I'm not, it's not a disaster if we don't. Right, we gotta get back home then, I guess. She's all the way up here. They say they can probably take care of it themselves. I'm not so sure. There's only two of you left. Let's get back, folks. We can defend the home, and then that's probably why I'll end the video. Give me time to sort of cry a bit more. Also, I can understand perhaps the guys wanting to move the practitioners because of that fucking bungalow. I can I can get behind that. No wonder they wanted some help in moving. I can I can dig this. I can dig this. Let's go then. One thing that does surprise me in this game, I don't know, maybe it's affected by difficulty. It's something that I feel like I've noticed. I don't know if you guys will agree. It doesn't feel like fuel lasts particularly long in cars. Like, um, I don't know if that's just me, but it feels like you should be able to get a lot more mileage out of cars before having to refuel again. Um, I know back in the state of the K1, in fact, I think in state of the K1, I'm not even sure cars even had, like, fuel consumption as such. They just drove. Um, I'm pretty sure state of the, K2, ugh, state of the K2 is the is when this thing comes in, but it just feels like that. Like, um, you know, it feels like that is uh, that is a thing. Right, let's drop off some stuff here because we've got access to this. We'll do this here to make life a little bit easier. Right, so we're going to drop that, 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 and that. Also, what am I going to use you for? For, um... I could give you munitions training. Yes. Let's see if we can give you some... We'll get you working on that. That sounds good to me. We'll give you some chemistry, and then eventually we'll get you to hopefully... Um, so you can perhaps do some uh, some munitions training and get you to construct more more ammo uh, more effectively. Like they say, knowledge is power. That sounds good to me. All right, let's get the rest of the stuff out the back of the car. Just saves me doing this now, then later. The load is quite heavy. I know. The game telling you, hey, you might want to take some, uh, you might want to look to take the, the food in first. It's pretty important. I'm like, yeah, it probably is. Drop all this all off here. Good. 
good, good. Right, what gun do I want you to use? The only thing that uses 5.56 is I don't think so. No. Alright. It would also be nice to be able to repair some fucking guns, but... That's good. Cool. All right, let's go back then and give uh, give the base a hand. Like I say, they say they'll take care of themselves. They probably can, but with injury, but not like if you had a load of people. But with two people, I'm not too convinced. Another gas station there, which is uncomfortably close to a freaking plague zone. I better keep an eye out for plague zone. So that's something that is a bit of a danger there, just to put it mildly. We haven't taken care of a play cart for a while. We've not really been in a position to. You know what I mean? The game has uh, certainly taken a lot of um, a lot of a lot of uh, hell to us. The trucker's not doing too bad though on fuel consumption, which I guess makes more sense. It, it feels like more like than say like a like a muscle car. Damn you. All right, I have an idea. If you get on the front bonnet... That's not what I wanted. Oh, shit. No. Well, I lost my door. It's not quite how I intended that. I was going to try and run the side of the car into something. It's not quite worked. Oh, he's taking off that door now? You bastard. Uh, game? Interesting. That's not quite how I intended that to go. Blades aren't gonna break. Here we go again. Uh, unhand me, you bitch. Rifle's not the best for taking out Pharaoh, as it must be stated. There goes that. Oh, boy. This is not working. Barrels. I what? That didn't hit it? Or kill it? Shots. There we go. That was pretty sweet. Right, we've got to change weapons here. Right, put that away. Uh, we need George to equip that. That'll do. Hello, everything. This game is pulling no punches. No punches whatsoever. I think Brayden and uh, Connor are just sitting up on the watchtower, largely out of harm's way. That's probably a good idea. Right, let's drop those off. <laughs> Tomsa, is this cheerful? I don't know why. Uh, what is it? Did you die? Thank you. There we go. We've survived. I almost can't believe it. <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. I was a bit nervous when I saw that juggernaut in the road. I was thinking, please don't fucking come this way. Whatever you do, please don't do this to me. All right, then. Let's grab these. More meds. I'm pretty sure we can stock all the meds. Oh, of course we can. We've got the food bank, so we can stock loads of medication. That's good. Did anything here that? No, it's fine. Isn't Ferry being the way? It doesn't particularly help, it must be stated, but hey ho. 
Right then, cool beans. So, uh, I suppose that's the end of the video as we begin our journey to slowly Sometimes piece ourselves together. And uh, we still kind of recuperate from the hell that's happened previous and all the bullshit. It's been tough, everyone. It's been tough. It's not game over yet by any stretch. Can I close this door, please? Thank you. But man, this game is not getting any easier. So I guess next time, um, I don't know what we do next next time. Uh, I think we're probably going to stay with um, Hawkins for a little while longer. Um, it looks like he's not tiring yet. So I think we're going to go ahead and look to do that then. So uh, let's just drop this quickly and put on like another gun of some kind. Uh, I might just give him the PPK and call it a day. We'll give him a shotgun. Shotgun sounds good. <laughs> Oh dear. That's that's not a good thing to see. I think there's trouble brewing on the horizon with a group that are looking to threaten us. That's that's not good. That's not good at all. Alright, then worry about it next time, folks. For the time being, we're done for this video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time in uh, Mega Valley is Hell. I'll see you then.